The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the SmackDown Women's Championship. It's Little Miss Bliss! Five feet of fury. Remember the good old days when Alexa Bliss would toss glitter and smile and make you feel good? I like the days better now, where you are not allowed to make direct eye contact with the goddess, Saxton. Is that why she never looks at me? Multi-time women's champion. Yeah, she's not afraid to remind you either. What an incredible career so far. are all about ratios. Maybe you'll get a date with one of them finally. Huh? Whoa. Listen to this reaction for Bailey. Saxton, don't you dare start with that whack you wave and inflatable blah, blah, blah garbage you spit out every time you see your precious Bailey. It's just an infectious feeling when Bailey comes to town, when Bailey competes. Everybody's feeling hug life. Except Corey. Introducing the challenger from Columbus, Ohio, Alexa Bliss. Introducing the champion from San Jose, California, the SmackDown Women's Champion, Bailey. So don't move a muscle. The huggable one taking on the goddess. Storied history between these two. One that has spelled heartache for Bailey and glee for Alexa. Yeah, Bailey was living a fairy tale defending her Raw Women's Championship in her home of San Jose. Unfortunately, sometimes the Wicked Witch wins, and Alexa spoiled Bailey's homecoming. Drop down. My leapfrog. Corey, we know Bailey can be a threat in the women's division, but her game isn't without its flaws. How should her opponent expose those? We've seen Bailey lack killer instinct. She won't go where other women often will. Take her to a place where she's uncomfortable, a place where her only chance to win would require ruthlessness, and watch her indecision destroy her. Drop down. Nice. That smart observation Corey made about Bailey's lack of a killer instinct has cost her in the past. 
Bailey is a sympathetic competitor, and that usually doesn't bode well in WWE. Well, Bailey has trouble getting extreme. It's not in her DNA. Perhaps it's best to back her into a corner where drastic measures would be her only option. Then take advantage of her hesitation. What grace! Float over into the... Absolutely spiked! DDT! I spoke with Bailey earlier tonight, and she told me she's not embarrassed or ashamed of the love and passion she had for WWE growing up. She's proud to look back at her poems and essays that convey her desires to be a superstar. Boom! <laughs> With what Byron said about Bailey's childhood essays in mind, it's safe to say that Bailey, just like the average fan in the crowd, her super fandom is what makes her relatable to everyone in the hugger section. Yeah, it may be true, but my sources in the San Jose School District tell me she got all Fs on those essays. Bailey's case of arrested development needs to end if she ever wants to be taken seriously as a WWE superstar. What a stop! Good grief! In the rules. With an endearing personality and affectionate demeanor, Bailey can appear to be a pushover, but that might be exactly what she wants you to think. Well, both sides of that coin are true. I would be very accepting of a Bailey hug outside of competition, but I would do all I can to avoid one in a match. Picking up Byron's wishful thinking of actually getting a hug from Bailey. It's true that in the confines of a match, Bailey's loving hug soon turns into a devastating Bailey to belly. I'm usually against Bailey's hugs, and that's all. I, I just don't like it. I don't care if I was in the ring or out of the ring. I just avoid them at all costs. Bailey on her heels now. So you're going to need to find a way to mount an offense here. If you're worried about her now, you haven't seen many of her matches. She can withstand so much more punishment than this. She has to be careful not to let this get out of hand here, guys. Yes, she's in better overall shape than her opponent, but... Oh, oh nice suplex. She's in complete control here, guys. You're going to want to see your internist after a slam like that. Bailey to belly! Bliss is out of it, guys. But now can Bailey capitalize? The history books will have to wait another day. And here's another peek of the moves he saw in that match. Nobody can say he didn't earn this win here. Really a solid, bordering on great performance. Here is your winner, and still the SmackDown Women's Champion, Bailey. And that's a win for Bailey. Few things are more rewarding than that feeling of keeping your opponent's shoulders.